Hello, fellow Roman salutors. Logical llama here. Most logical animal with long neck on internet. Fuck you, giraffes. In my continued quest to become most rational destroyer of crybaby cucks, I have been taking some pointers from the best. To do this, I must ask myself questions. What to do in certain situation? For example, what to do when lowly unpopular regressive tried to leech off my fame under guise of criticism. Luckily for me, many elfes, well, well two that I could find, but many elfes have shown me best response to criticism. Simply call other person or imply that other person is a child sexer. When double alpha omega squared skeptic face and totally not Trump supporter Carl Akkad Swindon of Sargon Benjamin of was viciously attacked by a regressive loser with minimal subscribers and a mustache monthly mouth model Michael Rollins, he didn't skip a beat. Advice, don't follow or link to a proven pedophile, yeah? Okay, so technically he implied that Loser Rollins supported pedophile, but you know, results all the same. Mindless zealots with no original thoughts of their own like what he said and fill dipshit Rollins' Twitter feed with tweet damning him for supporting pedo, even though Sarah Nyman is not proven pedophile and Carl is friends with Milo Snuffleupagus who is openly defending pedophiles. Easy win for Alpha. Why would Alpha bother defending his position when he can have hordes of brainwashed dipshits, I mean, uh, like-minded rational skeptics do it for him? Next example, super sensational science man and world first receiver of tree stump neck implant Thunderfzerzert received criticism of his totally not incitement of harassment and hatred for a woman with opinion online by... Oh, oh shit, yeah, it's that loser Rollins again. Man, he is such a tryhard. Um, anyway, Rollins destroyed Thunder Doofus with numbers and instead of bothering to come up with reasonable response, like a real scientist, guess what Thunder Christ did? Meh. It's only a matter of time before vocal male feminists come out as sexual predators. Seen it so many times. And his fans were quick to affirm. So, what has Logical Llama learned today from top examples of rational skeptics on internet? If someone challenges you on anything, simply imply that they gauge in or support one of the most deplorable acts known to humanity and then let your hordes do the rest. It is most rational response. As Einstein once said when challenged on his crazy ideas about physics, Oh yeah? Well, at least I don't touch children inappropriately. E equals MC squared, bitches! That's all for today. Remember, it's only okay to be outraged by pedophilia if it helps to further your agenda. That's logic straight from the llama's mouth.